Good happy Wednesday evening, December 2nd, 2020. I'm Riley King, and welcome to Sports with Riley King. Let's begin. Kelsey Hogan takes charge at UNH. Hogan is the first year coach of the women's hoop. Let's take a listen to that video from WMUR News 9, Jamie Staston. I joined Bellwether Community Credit Union two months ago. When we first got closed down, I was afraid that we were going to... She was part of the original freshman class at Nashua North High School, and now she is a freshman on the UNH, as the women's, UNH women's basketball coach, her first year just getting rolling. Jason King has more with Kelsey Hogan. A new era in women's basketball is underway in Durham. Nashua native Kelsey Hogan was named head coach in the offseason and says the opportunity is a dream come true. For me, um, I feel, gosh, every single day, just so grateful still to be where I am. Um, I'm, I'm excited to continue to grow with the young group that we, ha we have. Kelsey was the first 1,000-point scorer in the history of Nashua North High School and went on to become a three-year captain as a player at UNH. She then spent six seasons as an assistant coach with the Wildcats. Now in charge, her goal for this year's team is simple. With our tentative schedule this year, we want to compete. We want to be in every game. Uh, we want to just rebuild and kind of gain that competitive edge, um, especially with our youth that we have. Another long-term goal of Kelsey's for the program is to earn a spot in the NCAA tournament, something the Wildcats have never done. I will tell you that I, I think it is doable, absolutely. Um, and it needs to be because the women's basketball program at the University of New Hampshire deserves it. Kelsey says the journey begins with culture. Uh, we keep saying it's the Wildcat way. Uh, we're going to do it with hard work. We're going to do it with competing day in and day out. The Wildcats are off to an 0-2 start, but play their first home game on Saturday. Jason King, WMUR News 9 Sports. Okay, and there you go on that video and that report. Celtics to play next in Boston on Christmas Day, ESPN reports. The Boston Celtics will be playing on Christmas Day for the fifth straight year, according to an ESPN report. Celtics guard Kimba Walker undergoes stem cell injection in left knee, expected to miss start of the season. And the Baltimore Ravens, they had a game today. And let's take a look at the final score from the game. And the final score from their game, Baltimore Ravens 14 and Pittsburgh Steelers 19. The Pittsburgh Steelers won the game today. And that does it for this evening edition of Sports with Riley King. I hope you all have a great rest of your Wednesday evening, and I'll see you back here tomorrow for another edition of Sports with Riley King. Good night and goodbye, everyone.